everyone, I hope all of you are doing well. So if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that I posted a picture of Candy and the caption says, I've missed you guys, sorry for being gone so long. Comment any questions you have for me, I will be making a Q&A video soon. Love ya. So today's video is going to be the Q&A video and I'll be answering all your questions. And also in the caption I said I've missed you guys, sorry for being gone so long. So before I answer your questions, I quickly want to tell you guys where I've been. I have not uploaded a video in about three weeks, which is crazy. And I haven't even been on social media in like weeks, so I want to explain to you why I've been gone. So basically you guys know that I am completely honest with you if something happens in my life, I tell you. To tell you the truth, I have been gone for weeks because I have been struggling with depression. Um, you guys just know that I've gone through a lot this year and it's all kind of, sorry, it's all kind of been building up. Um, and I've been trying to put a smile on my face for the last months. And um, it's just really hard and it kind of just like I woke up one day and I was just depressed. I didn't want to get out of bed. I didn't even want to talk to anyone. So for weeks, I wasn't talking to family. I wasn't talking to friends. I was just sitting in my room all day and night and it just was not fun and I've been depressed. So I'm sorry for being gone so long, but I hope you understand. There is one main reason why I was depressed, which you guys will find out later in the video because someone asked a question that like the answer relates perfectly to why I was depressed. So you guys will find out later in the video. But as you can see, I am doing a lot better and um, it's just crazy because I like to post at least once a week so the fact that I haven't posted in three weeks is crazy but I am feeling a lot better so I will hopefully be posting at least once a week again I am excited to be back and I just wanted to say thank you for understanding now that you guys know where I have been I just want to quickly um, answer your questions and I kind of feel like this video is gonna be kind of long so I'm kind of sorry but if I don't answer your question it's because I've answered it in a previous video my 50 facts about me video or my other Q&A video so I will link those down below so if your question isn't in this video it might be in another video so yeah I will just be answering all of your questions now so the first question someone said what are you doing after high school and a lot of people asked about college and high school and stuff like that so I feel like a lot of people don't know this but I actually am not in high school anymore I graduated back in May so instead of college I decided to go to a makeup school it's called makeup first and it's in Chicago tomorrow is November 10th and November 10th is my last day of school, so I'm so excited that school is ending, like that's crazy. Um, but basically the makeup school I go to is only 11 weeks long, and at the end of the courses you get your certificate. So tomorrow I will get my certificate and I will be a makeup artist. So yeah, that's what I decided to do after high school, and then since school is ending tomorrow, I guess after that it's just time to work. Get a job and do people's makeup and keep doing YouTube, of course. So a lot of people asked what my favorite candy is, and my favorite candy is definitely Hershey kisses I could seriously if someone gave me a bag of Hershey kisses I could eat the whole bag in like two days because once I have one I cannot stop eating them and I will eat a whole bag so fast I am addicted but Hershey kisses are definitely my favorite candy many people also asked what my favorite music was what my favorite artist was and I honestly don't have a favorite I definitely listen to a ton of music just all different genres and different artists I don't have a specific favorite where do you see yourself and your YouTube in 10 years? So in 10 years, I will be 28. That's really scary. But I will be 28, um, hopefully married, have a couple kids, doing people's makeup. And then also for my YouTube, I'll still be doing this channel. And also when I do have like my own family, I want a vlog channel, kind of like the Shades Hearts and Ellie and Jared. That's definitely what I want to do when I'm older. So that's where I see myself in 10 years. A lot of you guys asked how it's going with my new house. And for those of you guys who don't know, in April my house burned down. Um, then we lived in a hotel for a month. And then now we're living in this like little townhouse just until our new house is done being built. And it is going really good. If I can, I'll insert a picture right here of what it looks like right now. It's just so exciting to see the plans like come to life. And I'm just so excited to show you guys the finished product. Oh, and really quick, I wasn't going to tell you guys this until like it was done. But I am working on a video I've been working on it for a couple months and it's basically a video about like building my house like you're gonna see like the progress and like the whole journey of building my house and it should be done in January because that's when my house will be finished so that is a surprise video coming in January so for those of you who are watching this who are 
are the only ones who know about it. Many people asked about Netflix, what I like to watch on Netflix, my favorite shows, favorite movie, and on Netflix, my favorite show um, in general is Friends, and Friends is on Netflix, and then I also, okay, American Horror Story, I discovered that on Netflix, and season two is my favorite, but if you haven't seen it, it can be a little scary and a little weird at some times. There are some weird scenes, so just be warned, but if you do like scary stuff, uh, I think you would really like it. And then when it comes to movies, um, I love Audrey Hepburn, and one of her movies is called Roman Holiday, and that is my favorite movie of hers. It's really old, it's in like black and white, so if you do like old movies, and I think you would really like Roman Holiday. So I really like this next question. It's if you are going to have kids, what will their names be? And it's kind of funny because I feel like, I don't know about you guys, but I've always thought about what I'm going to name my kids. You guys know that I want four kids, two girls and two boys, but the boys, I have no idea what I will name them. I have never known about boy names. When I do have a son, I will definitely need some help picking out a name, but girls, right now I like Audrey. <laughs> um, I like Viviana. I think that's really pretty. And then if you watch the Shaytards, you know they have a daughter named Avia, and I just think that's a really pretty name. Avia, Audrey, and Viviana are my favorite names right now. Um, I just think they're kind of unique in a way, like I don't hear them too often, so I really like them. So yeah, I really like those names. Okay, so the next question is going to answer why I have been depressed the last few weeks. And the question is, what is your best advice on getting over someone? I honestly do not have good advice because my boyfriend broke up with me about four months ago and I'm still not over him and that is why I have been depressed. I mean, everything that happened this year obviously is affecting me. So getting over someone is extremely hard. As I said, it's been about four months and I'm still not over him. I still love him. I still want him. I still miss him. I miss him like crazy. When I tell you guys these things, don't think he's a bad person because like he didn't break up with me to hurt me. He did it because he thought that was a good decision. Like I wish we were friends but I just feel like he doesn't want to be friends but I really wish we were because like every day I see something or I hear about something and I just want to text him be like hey did you hear about this or did you see this or guess what happened and I don't know I just I miss talking to him, so basically best advice on getting over someone. Like that's really hard to answer just because I'm going through it right now, trying to get over someone and it's really hard. So just understand that it takes time. It's a really hard question to answer, so that is why I was depressed, mainly just because I miss Nick. So the next question is, what made you want to start a YouTube channel? I have been watching YouTube ever since I was young, like just watching goofy videos with friends and just like really silly little kid videos. Um, and then when I was a freshman in high school, I really started getting into the beauty videos. Like Juicy Star 07, my best friend and I would watch her all the time, like her older videos. Um, and we really liked her and we just really got into the beauty videos. And I don't know if this is weird or if any of you guys do it too, but like when I started doing my makeup, I would be like, okay, and now I'm gonna use this brush, and I would like start talking while doing my makeup, as if there was a camera in front of me, but there wasn't, and I was like, I love beauty videos, why not start a channel and make them? So that is what made me want to start a channel, and I am so happy I did. <laughs> When's your birthday? Oh my gosh, okay, so I'm freaking out right now. Okay, so my birthday is July 31st. <laughs> but you're probably like wondering why I'm freaking out. So I got an email from a woman named Laura. She works with FamousBirthdays.com, which is an online website. It says that they get like millions of views each month. And basically you go to FamousBirthdays.com and like the home screen, it shows like whose birthdays are today and like who's are tomorrow and it's just like famous people so you type in someone's name and then you find out when their birthday is oh my gosh so I got an email and she said that people have been searching my name you guys are awesome basically if you put in my name Kat Harmon I pop up like how crazy is this like I am on their website and it says July 31st 1997 I was born in Illinois I'm 18 my birth sign is Leo and then it has like some information about me but I just think that's so crazy how you guys have been searching my name and now I'm on famousbirthdays.com so thank you guys that is awesome but yeah that's when my birthday is <laughs> so someone asked what my favorite band was and my favorite band is definitely the Beatles I love the Beatles and my favorite Beatle is Paul McCartney and then I also love Fleetwood Mac they're so good um so I would say those are my two favorite bands right now 
I like this question. It says, what's your biggest insecurity? And that is acne. I've always had acne. You guys can't really see it, I don't think, because I wear makeup. Thank God for this little guy, um, because I do struggle with acne. In my everyday makeup routine video, you guys see my bare face, but that was a good day. That was like when I didn't have a lot of acne. So that's like why I filmed it that day. But right now my face is so bad. I do get really bad acne. I have since eighth grade. That is my biggest insecurity. <laughs> do you like One Direction? It's kind of funny because I never liked them. But then all of a sudden I once got into a phase where I really liked them. I wanted to go to like a concert of theirs. Um, but now I don't really like them anymore. But I used to. So the next question I thought was a really good question. And it's if you weren't into makeup, what job would you want? If I wasn't into makeup, I honestly love filming videos for you guys. So possibly like a videographer. I think that's what you call it. Um, I was even thinking about doing it and doing makeup. Like I still might be a videographer. I don't know. But like making videos for like people's weddings or like special events. I just love making little videos and it's really fun. I love editing, filming, all of that. Definitely, if I wasn't a makeup artist, I would want to be a videographer. I hope I'm saying that right. I hope that's an actual thing. So yes, that's what I would want to be and maybe I might be that too. So you never know. Favorite sport. My favorite sport is definitely hockey. I love to watch it. My team is the Blackhawks. If any of you guys like the Blackhawks, you guys are awesome. Those are all the questions. Thank you guys once again for supporting me through all of this. I love you guys so much more than you will ever know. You guys, I mean, I say that a lot, but it's completely true. I love you guys. I hope you guys like this video, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye, guys.